All right, let's get this stream kicked off. Something to get me in the mood, pumped up for today. Play this clip, South Carolina game last year, 2019, to get us in the mood. And let everybody file in here. Football's a game of emotions and intensity. Intensity. We need everybody in this room to bring the energy today. Right now, right now for play one. And if you're on that sideline, you bring up energy to your teammates. You got that? Everybody knows what we're working for. Everybody knows what we're working for. When you're one-on-ones, when you're one-on-ones, the most physical team, the most relentless team, we're staying together, never quit, we're finding a way. Game talks and balls from historic Neyland Stadium in Knoxville on a perfect October Saturday. Up. Bang, he goes down. It's Daryl Taylor. All the way back to his own 36. He's got two career punt returns for touchdowns. Make it three. 65 yards. Wide open is Jennings, already past midfield. And look at the extra effort. Has time. Jennings inside the 20. Stays on his feet. Will not be denied. 48 yards. Hit right there and knocked down. What a big stop. Linsky under pressure. Down he goes. Deep ball. He's got Callaway. Caught. He gets rid of the throws for Jennings in the end zone. Got it. Touchdown in the back of the end zone. Jawan Jennings good for 19 yards. Fires long. Callaway behind everybody. Catches at the 15. To the 10. To the 5. Touchdown. Touchdown. Marquez Callaway. We were just saying. What about these explosive plays by Tennessee? Man, there's a highlight reel tonight. And blocked! The Volunteers cover it in the end zone! Touchdown! Daniel Matuli! Talking about a team win. Alright, a team win. Right. That's how you find ways to win football games. Okay, that's how you find ways to win football games. We were the most physical team on the field. We played the hardest. Right. We played together. We didn't quit. Okay, All right. and y'all said it. All right. When the things didn't go our way, we put on more put on money. Money. What's going on, Vol fans? Man. Get me pumped up. Here, old Jim Chaney. Can he get fired up or what? Man, I didn't know he was that that assertive in that locker room. He's getting with it. Anyway, VFL in the lane was canceled for the weekend. Labor Day, Jarnell Stokes and Alexis Hornbuckle taking the week off. So I said, what can I do to replace that? It's hard to replace VFLs, but I thought I'd get on here and go back – down memory lane, played that clip from South Carolina last year, the highlights, credit to the University of Tennessee. And guess what? 21 days till it's football time in Tennessee. We take on South Carolina. Fingers crossed that we get to see some football on the TV. We're going to be at T- Tennessee Tap House every Saturday broadcasting pregame with VFLs. Uh, my partner, Billy Ratliff, big worm number 40 from the national championship year. And the Sterner stumble claim to fame. We're going to be out there. We're also going to be out there this Saturday uh, doing some cornhole at Tennessee Tap House. Maybe playing some Madden or NCAA 14 inside on them big old 100 inch TVs. Free sweet tea for everybody. We're going to have merchandise there UT merchandise, man, hats, shirts, uh, license plates, you name it, tents. Chairs, all kinds of tailgating stuff. We're going out there and 20% off of everything we sell this Saturday. Well, week from today. So I thought I'd go down memory lane in my first game. Long time ago. Some of y'all youngins probably weren't even thought of. Some of you youngins' parents probably wasn't even born when I, my first game. 1979 Notre Dame game. Now, I was 10 years old. All right, so... Don't remember a lot about the game, and this will be the first time that I've watched this game uh, on TV. 
And since I was old enough to really remember any rules about football, so I don't remember a lot about the game. I remember Johnny Majors coming out on the field, one of his first big wins against highly ranked Notre Dame, first ever meeting, I believe, between uh, Notre Dame and Tennessee, at least at Neyland Stadium. So I thought I'd go out back and pull up a little YouTubes. Everybody likes YouTubes, but let's let me get some Go Vols, and at the end of the – so I'm going to give away some free merch, maybe a Tennessee license plate or a hat or something. So give me some go balls, comment during the, during the uh, replay here, and I'll pick out the best comment. We'll, we'll win something on YouTube and Facebook. I don't even know if we're streaming on YouTubes. Let me go over here and see. We might not even be going on over there. Um, cause I don't know if I got it set up or not, but we're going to find out. Uh, yeah, we got Slim Mosley. How you don't, doing? He's a Georgia fan. So Slim Mosley, watch a real team. Y'all didn't have football back in 79. Y'all weren't that good. Well, y'all were that good. Y'all won your first championship the year after this, 1980. And may I remind you, Slim Mosley, that was your last national championship was 1980. See, y'all probably pretty good back then. But I doubt you could have beaten Notre Dame in 1979. I believe uh, that was before Lou Holtz. I think that was uh, – who was the coach at Notre Dame back then? Divine? I don't remember. I'm not good on sports history, sports trivia. But we're going to go down memory lane. We're going to watch this together. I'm going to try – see, i got to stop this. Let me prepare you all right now. i got to stop this because we got copyright infringement possibilities. So I know a lot of you all don't like my commentary, but to stay out of trouble with their lawyers – I've got to stop and critique or say something every now and then. So just bear with me. I apologize in advance. Uh, but let's watch this 40-18 to 18 butt whooping that Tennessee put on. Jimmy Streeter, my first hero quarterback. I believe uh, was Anthony Hancock in this game. Pretty sure Anthony Hancock was this, in this game, wide receiver. Um, so let's get this thing cranked up. Give me a minute. Let me get, get things lined up here. We're going to watch this game together. Man, I got people calling me. I got to turn my ringer off or they're going to keep calling me. Um, let's see. I got to get this thing going here. All right. Sit back. Get you some popcorn. Coca-Cola. Moon pie. RC Cola. Some peanuts in your coat, whatever you want to snack on. This is about 40 some minutes. We're going to watch the game. It's not the entire game. I think it's a sped up version of the game. But from what I understand and remember when I skimmed through it, I just skimmed through it like every five or 10 minutes skip just to see what the quality was. It, it's the entire game. And then we might, if y'all want, we'll watch the Johnny Major show that happened the Sunday, the next day on TV. We'll see. So give me some go balls, some commentary during that, and I may stop and read your comments. But here we go. Neyland Stadium, Knoxville, Tennessee, November 10, 1979. The Saturday afternoon volunteer fans have been waiting for. Notre Dame comes to Knoxville. The first time ever for the Fighting Irish and the volunteers to meet at Neyland Stadium. The pie of the Southland band. The capacity crowd. Temperature 57 degrees. Perfect for football. And right now as the balls race out to the field, it's football time in Tennessee. Let me stop it right there. How many of y'all remember when they ran through the tee from the sideline? I remember it. Do y'all remember it? That's been a long time ago. Let's keep going. Sorry. For Tennessee, Roland James and Craig Pukey meeting in the center of the field with the Notre Dame representatives. And it will be Notre Dame winning the toss, electing to receive. Tennessee will defend the north goal. And Alan Duncan will be kicking off with the Volunteers. Notre Dame, Tennessee, Knoxville. Here is Duncan and here's the kick. 
It goes on bouncing through the end zone. And so Notre Dame will have the ball after the touchback. First down, Tennessee with the 20-yard line. Tennessee in all orange, as you see. Notre Dame with the white jerseys. The long pass downfield by Lish. It is complete. Pulled down by Hunter. And Hunter carries the ball forward for a gain of 36 yards. Brilliant first play by Notre Dame. The Fighting Irish come out with the 36-yard first down pass. And at the Volunteer 44, it's first down 10, Notre Dame. Vegas Ferguson, right side, got two yards, maybe three. Davis there on the stop for Tennessee. Second down, about oh, eight yards to go. Lish, the quarterback, pitch Ferguson. Ferguson cuts back, he's hit and front. Danny Spradlin and Craig Pukey, both there on the stop. Third down, still right at eight yards to go. Lish against Tennessee's five-man front. Drop, look, pass, complete. And breaking the tackle and spinning forward is Houlihan. He carries for a gain of 14 yards, and so Notre Dame will have it first down 10 to go. Nothing to nothing to score. Banging through right guard, this is Sweeney. Got a yard that time, making it second down and nine. Pitch, Ferguson. 25, 20, 15, great cutback, 10, knocked cleanly down as he carries the ball to the volunteer six-yard line. Vegas Ferguson gives Notre Dame first down, goal to go at the Tennessee six-yard line. Nothing to nothing to score. Give Ferguson right side. He pounds forward, crashing down close to the goal line. Forward progress marked at the two-yard line. Second down, goal to go. Notre Dame, nothing to nothing. Sweeney, right side, nothing there. Stacked up by the left side of the Tennessee line. Jones, the first man there. It's got to be third down goal. Ferguson, left side. He did not make it. He was stopped by Danny Spradlin. Number 50, and it will be... Good old Danny Spradlin. Goal. Notre Dame is going to try for the touchdown, not the field goal. Tennessee digging in, goal line stand. Nothing to nothing. Hunkered to down one time. Man in motion now reverses back. Lish, Ferguson, touchdown, ah. Notre Dame. Ferguson battles in for the score. The extra point is up, and the kick is no good. It's off to the white. So the field goal, the extra point attempt by Mayo is no good. And Notre Dame leads Tennessee six to nothing. Mayo will be kicking off deep for Tennessee. Gary Moore at the five. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, out to the 40 yard line. There you go. Gary Moore. Tennessee will have it first down, 10 to go. Trailing Notre Dame, 6 to nothing. Jimmy Streeter is the Tennessee quarterback. Jimmy Streeter, Barry a and first Simpson hero. are the running backs. Notre Dame in a five-man front. Linebackers dancing around. Streeter back to throw on first down. Long pass, Streeter downfield. It is incomplete. Intended is that Hancock? For reaching Anthony Hancock. I told you all at the beginning of the show I thought Hancock was in this game. I was right. I remember something. And it will be second down and 10. Notre Dame went 36 yards on its first play on a pass. Tennessee almost goes even further. Handoff, Hubert Simpson left side, gets a hole, spinning, turning, driving. Simpson drives for 11 yards. A second look. Simpson turning forward for a gain of 11. It's first down, 10 to go Tennessee at midfield. Notre Dame five-man front. Notre Dame splits uh, its linebackers as Tennessee handoff goes to James Berry, and Berry comes darting over the right side of the line. Good old James Berry. For a gain of six yards. It's a familiar name. It's Berry carrying, and actually it's a gain of a little over 10, so it's got to be first down and 10 for Tennessee. Streeter pitching. Berry in trouble. He's got to be thrown for mm, a loss. Mm. James Berry hit behind the line of scrimmage. It's a loss of six, making it second down 16. Pass complete. Reggie Harper makes the reception. Is knocked down by Gibbons. Let's take a second look. Jimmy Streeter. There's the pass. There's Reggie Harper. 
And Harper is twisted down, but Tennessee picks up 12, and it will be third down and four. The ball's trail six to nothing. Ball on the left hash mark. Back to the eye formation. Pitch goes to the tailback. Simpson. Simpson turns. He drives. He battles his way. It's very, very close. First down, 10 to go, Tennessee. Hubert Simpson for the first down. At the 29, Simpson stopped. No gain, shoved back. We'll check that forward progress, and it's marked back at about the line of scrimmage. Second down, 10. Notre Dame stays in a five-man front. Tennessee misdirection, pitch goes. Simpson slowed, fights his way for a couple of yards, but great defensive effort that time by Jorison. Gain of two, third down, eight. Streeter spreading out to the left side. Here comes a blitz. Streeter eludes. He'll run. 25, twisting his way down to the 21-yard line. Tennessee, fourth Rest down. Rest in peace, two. Mr. Streeter. Notre Dame leads 6 My first nothing. Tennessee hero. Jimmy Streeter visiting with head football coach Johnny Majors. The decision has been made, and Tennessee on fourth and two is going to try for the first down. Notre Dame, six. Tennessee, nothing. Running backs split. Streeter. Simpson, first down, he keeps the ball and battles his way on. Hubert Simpson gives Tennessee a first down, grinding over the right side of the line for six yards. And it will be for Tennessee, first down and 10 to go. Hubert Simpson again, lunging his way from the 14 to the 10, at which point Tennessee will have it second down, six to go for the first down. Simpson again, stacked falls forward for a yard down to the nine where it's third down and five. Notre Dame six, Tennessee nothing. Streeter sprints out, pass complete. Barry pulls it down and immediately fells into the turn. Barry. And once more, Tennessee is faced with a fourth down situation. It will be fourth down and inches. Got to go for it. The Irish leading six to nothing. Tennessee to the line at the Notre Dame four yard line. Jimmy Streeter, the quarterback. Checking off of the line, running back Simpson, play action, Streeter keeps, four, three, two, give him six, touchdown, Tennessee. Touchdown, Tennessee. Let's stop it right there. How many of y'all, I don't want to see in the comments, I want to see them go back to all orange, all orange britches, all orange jersey like that. Man, that's back in the day. Remember the stripe down the middle of the helmet? those of you just joining in, let's see some commentary, and I'm going to pick out for a free hat or shirt, whatever you want from Volunteer Roadshow, great Tennessee apparel. Give me some go vols in the comment section. Those of you just joining in, I'm going back down memory lane. My first game, 1979, highly ranked Notre Dame comes to town, comes to Knoxville, Neyland Stadium, gets a dose at the Big Orange Nation and Rocky Top. We're going to go back and watch this game. Both teams have scored uh, first possessions. So I quit flapping my gums and let's get back with it. But I love those uniforms. Jimmy Streeter sidestepping and then dances into the end zone and the volunteers pull into a tie. Extra point of try attempt now by Duncan. It's in the air. The kick by Duncan is good. Tennessee seven, Notre Dame six. Each team has had possession but one time in the first quarter. Notre Dame went to score 80 yards. Tennessee after a brilliant kickoff return by Gary Moore marches downfield. Grabbing the lead, seven to six. Duncan kicking off for the Volunteers. Hits it long all the way through the end zone, as you see. And so, it will be Notre Dame putting the ball in play first down and 10 to go at the 20-yard line. Lish, pass complete, screen, there's a penalty marker down. Barber has the ball for 15, for 20, for 25, for 30. He's finally bumped out of bounds after a 32-yard gain. But there is a penalty marker down, and the indication is that Notre Dame is guilty of holding. I see a slim shady on you, too. But we look better in all arms than Miami the ball does. back down. 
Glad Notre you're in Dame here. With it. Hand off goes. Vegas Ferguson pounded by Ingram and White after a gain of four. Second down, 21 to go. And Notre Dame guilty again of an infraction. This time it will be half the distance for delay of game. Lish, the pass complete. The grab is made by Hunter for a gain of 16 yards, tackled by Martin. Third down, nine. Lish again. This pass is incomplete. Hunter had come open, probably had first down yardage. But the pass is juggled, and here comes Buska on to punt. Deep for Tennessee, Roland James. The ball's lead, seven to six. I remember that name, Roland Nearing James, played linebacker, quarter. I believe. Correct Lish me in the comments. James, 45. Looks he was a star block. back then. Turns to the 50 and is horse collared and shoved out of bounds as he returns to the Notre Dame side of the midfield strike. Tennessee first down 10 at the 47 yard line. Hubert Simpson starts left, cuts back for a gain of two, maybe three yards. Closer to two, making it second down and eight. Tackled by Hankard on the play. Pitch. Simpson racked up by Whittington and Mamer as the first quarter comes to a close. At the end of one, Tennessee seven, Notre Dame six. Tennessee now will be moving to your left toward the north end of the football field. Quarterback remains Jimmy Streeter. Rolling out to the right side on third down. In trouble. Will run. 40 hit from behind and spun down as he moves the ball to the 38-yard line. At which point Tennessee's going to have it. Fourth down. And the balls again will try for the first down. Hand off Glenn Ford. He's got it. As there Glenn you go. Ford slashes over the right side of the line. Moving for three yards in a first down. First and ten at the Notre Dame 35. Tennessee leads seven to six. Again, it's Glenn Ford. And he comes banging through the left side of the line from a pickup of five yards on the play. Second Playing down good old smash mouth football. Pitch Simpson at the corner. Runs through a tackle, turns the corner, and then runs out of real estate as he's shoved out of bounds. And it will be for Tennessee, third down and two. Barry back into the lineup for the Volunteers. Single flanker wide to the left side. Barry, in front Notre Dame. familiar name. Handoff goes to Barry. Barry, quick opening play, right side, pounds forward. Needed two, got it. First down, 10 to go, Tennessee. Ball rests at the 24-yard line of the Irish. Tennessee leading seven to six. Quarterback Streeter, handoff Simpson, 20, 15, Simpson, 10, 5, touchdown, Tennessee. Touchdown. A second look at Hubert Simpson, breaks a tackle there. Man, that gets there, me pumped. Sidesteps a man there and is convoyed into the end zone. Tennessee leads. That's Aguilard along with Reggie Harper downfield, two tight ends, and the Volunteers are on top. Duncan will attempt the extra point. Jacobs holds, the kick is up. The kick by Duncan is good. Tennessee 14, Notre Dame 6. 14 to 6, those, those of you just tuning in. I'm going down memory lane. My first big orange ball game. And had some great comments over here. Butch Gibson said the best college football on today, go Vols. Hopefully in 21 days, there'll be a lot better football on when we take on South Carolina and take them to the woodshed like we've been needing to do for a long time. And we get, finally did it here recently against Muschamp. I believe that was our first victory against Muschamp last year. But anyway, got pumped up uh, watching that uh, pregame speech by Cheney for South Carolina last year. And Jarnell Stokes and Alexis Hornbuckle wasn't able to do a show today, their normal show at noon. So I thought I'd go down memory lane. Let me have some go balls, some great comments, and I'll pick out – Somebody at the end of the show gets a free hat and a free shirt. Uh, good quality Tennessee stuff. I and mean, we got some great selections. 
And don't forget, we'll be at Tennessee Tap House on Peters Road, Knoxville, Tennessee, this next Saturday playing cornhole and maybe even some Madden or some college football on the big old TV screen. Just having a great old time. But let's get back to it. 14 to 6. Big Orange over highly ranked Notre Dame. Let's get with it. Number 32, Hubert Simpson. 24 yards on the touchdown scamper. The Vols will be kicking off. This is Alan Duncan seeing the ball up as you see on the west, uh, the east side. Here's the kick coming downfield. Taken by Notre Dame. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Carries that ball forward as struggling out on the return was Notre Dame, Adele. Notre Dame, Lish, screen pass, Ferguson. Great speed and power, bumped out of bounds, but he ranges forward for a gain of 12 yards, and it will be first down 10 at the Notre Dame 45-yard line. Tennessee converges on Ferguson with White and Spradlin. No gain at all on the play. It will be second down and 10. The balls lead 14 to 6 in the second quarter. Ball rests at the Notre Dame 45. The Irish with Lish back to throw. Here's the pass. It is intercepted Tennessee. Lamont Holt. Holt on the deflection returns the interception. There you go. INT. A second look as Lish. The ball is tipped right there and alertly. Lamont Holt, the strong safety, makes the interception. Tennessee at the 46-yard line. Jimmy Streeter at quarterback. Man in motion, Jacobs. Streeter, play action. Keeps, turns, 50. Streeter, 45, 40. There you go. That's what I remember about Streeter. Go, boy. 15, 10. Go. Out of bounds. Close to the goal line. <laughs> Man, Jimmy I miss Streeter, Jimmy Streeter. Second look. The quickness, the speed. A second look. The deceptiveness. Silva, North Carolina's Jimmy Streeter trying for that pylon is bumped out of bounds. Just a I believe he side. got in. What do y'all think? I think he Tennessee stretched the ball out over the pylon. We need instant replay. 51 yards on that scamper. Throw the red flag, By Johnny Streeter. Majors. They Re- review the that. Three yard line. Tennessee to the line. Quarterback is Streeter. Hand off Simpson through the left side, struggling. Caught, shoved back. He was stopped by Jurson. It will be second down goal. Well, he got a little tippy with Simpson. Simpson diving, touchdown. There you go. Notre Dame don't even know what hit him. Highly ranked Notre Dame getting punched in the mouth and learning all the words to Rocky Top. Here's Alan Duncan to attempt the extra point. Tennessee now leads by a score of 20 to 6. The kick is in the air, and the kick by Duncan is good. Tennessee 21, Notre Dame 6, second quarter. And Alan Duncan will be kicking off. I'm going to give some shout outs over here on YouTube. I missed them on the last turnaround. Before I do, Rick says, so great to hear John Ward's voice calling the game, but Bill Anderson was great too. Man, they had great chemistry. Best ever. Best in history. John Ward, Bill Anderson. Let me go back here. I've seen some Gator fans over here on YouTube, and I think a Miami Hurricane fan. Let me figure this out here. Uh, Ballard Sports. Was this a bowl game? No, it's regular season, November, I believe, in 1979. Highly ranked Notre Dame comes to town. That's my first game. So we're going down memory lane. Tennessee Curtis said he loves watching old games. Me too. Good to see you, Space Mountain. How you doing? Um, let's see. Slim Shady Kane said we'll have to agree to disagree. I think it's about me saying Tennessee looks better in all orange than the Hurricanes. But let's get back, back with it. Get back to the butt whooping. Deep is Adel. Back there along with Stone for Notre Dame. Here comes Duncan. 
A kick end over end. Adell. Stepped out of bounds at the one yard line. Wow. A second look as Adell torn with indecision. He made the catch and then stepped out of bounds. And Notre Dame will have it first down and 10 at its one yard line. Lish, play action, rolling left in trouble. He's got to be thrown <laughs> for safety. Brian Ingram crashes through and drops Lish for a safety. A second look. A second look. Tennessee stringing it out. Lish wants to run now, but he's in trouble, and he knew it. And Brian Ingram throws him in the end zone, and so Notre Dame will have the free kick. Tennessee now leads 23 to 6. The placement. Johnny the Bass 20. says he remembers that play. Gary Moore, 25, 30. Back to the 34 yard line, and he is. Banging. I've got to give com commentary on this on game. I hate to interrupt, and y'all have to listen to my voice instead of the great Tennessee. John Ward, but Handoff. I'll get into copyright infringements if I'm not the analyzing line. the game Seven and commenting on, the on game. it. Second down for I Tennessee. I've got to stop it every Streeter. now and then. Quick pass. It's popped incomplete. Reggie Harper makes the catch and moves to midfield. 11 yards on the play. It will be first down 10 for Tennessee. Notre Dame in a three-man front. Streeter back to throw. Long pass downfield. Here's Hancock complete. Hancock carries the ball all the way down to the one-yard line. On the post route. Let's watch Streeter, this again. Does this knee go the down? Pass perfectly in stride to Anthony Hancock. Only the desperation yeah, lunge. I thought he landed on that back of that player. It was Jorson on the stop, and Tennessee will have it first down and goal. Running back split. Notre Dame in a six-man front. Streeter sneaks. Did not make it all the way. Got about a yard. They spotted the ball at the one and a half. It's down inside the one-yard line now. Tennessee leading 23 to Notre six. Dame don't even know what hit him. The line moving toward the north end. Notre Dame digging in defensively. Streeter. Simpson, touchdown, Tennessee. Give him six. The North Bleachers come alive as Tennessee scores another touchdown. And here's the extra point by Allen Duncan. It is up and it is good. Tennessee 30. Notre Dame. Got to take my copyright infringement break. Get some shout outs over here on Facebook. John Basket to hear you. He remembered that safety. Uh, YouTube, I'll get some shout outs. For those of you just joined in, give me some go vols and some commentary, and I'll pick out a comment or two at the end and give away some free Tennessee volunteer merchandise. Let's see here. Uh,. I'm not getting anything on YouTube. I know the comments over there. There we go. I don't know, uh, Slim Shady. I thought it was Divine, but I'm sure they'll mention him throughout this game. This is a sped-up version of the game. Slim Shady won enough. It was Jerry Faust was the coach. Uh, but let's get with it. Sorry for stopping it, but I've got to stay out of trouble with YouTubes. Six. The kicking game all important, and here's Duncan banging it again downfield. Notre Dame. Fumble, kicks the ball out of bounds. And for the second straight time, Notre Dame muffs the kickoff. As this time, Adele fumbled it and then kicked it out of bounds. And Tennessee goes on defense as Notre Dame has the ball. Back to throw, pass complete. That's Hunter. Great tight end making the catch. After an exchange of interceptions, we pick up the ball with Notre Dame. First and 10 at its 28-yard line. Reverse, faked, keeping the ball, and scampering forward comes Vegas Ferguson. He gets free and rambles out for a gain of 12 yards on the play. Pukki made the stop at the 40. First and 10, Notre Dame. Lish, off play action, looks to throw. The pass, it is complete. This time, the reception made by Mastak for a gain of 11 yards. It's first down 10. At the volunteer 49-yard line. Holohan in motion to the left side. Lish 
The pass, it is complete. This time the catch is made by Dickerson. Gain of seven. Down to the volunteer 42. It will be second down and three. Lish rolling left, looks to throw. Here's the pass. It is complete underneath the Holohan. And Holohan moves forward for the first down. Notre Dame first down 10 at the Tennessee 30. Pitch to Vegas Ferguson. Yeah, we're whipping them, Rick. Ferguson carries the ball forward just about to the 25-yard line. Tackle as he gets there, and it will be second down. Five and a half yards to go. The ball is digging in defensively, leading 30 to 6 in this football game, trying to stop Notre Dame. And this is Vegas Ferguson. Big hole up the middle. Great blocking in the interior line for the Irish, and it's Ferguson driving forward for an 11 yard gain. It's first down at 10 at the volunteer 15. Ferguson again gets a block. Ferguson lunges his way to the 10 yard line, is shoved back. But it will be a pickup of five, and it will be second down and five as Roland James is there on the stop. There you go. I told you he played linebacker. Second down, five to go for the first down. Ten to go Roland for the James. touchdown. Roland James. Notre Dame, man in motion to the left, Holohan. The give to Ferguson. Ferguson driving his way forward for the first down. Somersaulted down by James. It will be first down and goal for Notre Dame. Vegas Ferguson, the All-American running back. The key to this drive. This is he. This is Ferguson. Touchdown, Fighting Harry. I got to let them have a point or two so they don't forfeit the game before the game's over. Yeah, that UT did look small in the middle of the field. I was noticing that. The U was white and the T was orange. Been a long time ago. Rolling right. Here's the pass. It's deflected, and it is no good. So the score remains. Tennessee 30, Notre Dame 12. Let's stop right there. Let's have a vote on Facebook and YouTube. Who likes the big orange power T at the 50-yard line or the UT? What was it, 97 or... It was mid nineties. They changed from the UT to the power T. I'll give you my, my preference, uh, here later on the show, but let's see it in Facebook, YouTube, your preference to power T 50 yard line or the UT like this game. Well, this one was, a, I believe it was a white U and an orange T that looked pretty good. I don't remember that too, too much. So let's get back with it. Mayo will kick off high end over end effort. Backing up, making the reception, and then downing the ball in the end zone will be Gary Moore. Jimmy Streeter brings his team to the line. Hand off. This is James Berry. 25, 30, 35, 40, Go Barry. 45 yard line. James Berry sees daylight at the right side, and he drives forward for 25 yards on the play. First down 10, Tennessee. Streeter in trouble, fights back to the line of scrimmage. That's about all. Bob Crable was there. And on the play, Streeter shaken up and injured, and he's being helped to the sideline. A costly, costly possibility. David Rutter will be in their quarterback now for Tennessee. A walk-on has earned a scholarship. And it is he who is now the quarterback for the Volunteers. Tennessee leading, but Streeter is injured. Rudder in trouble. Will run. Penalty marker down. Rudder to the 45. Rudder all the way to the 40-yard line. Fumbles the football. There's a scramble for it. Uh-oh, fumble. Tennessee holding. guilty of holding. Also of clipping. But Notre Dame recovering the fumble by Rudder. Declines the penalties, and so Notre Dame has a chance. A long, long pass is complete. Tremendous catch by Notre Dame's Kishi. Notre Dame got a little life, but ain't enough to come back from the dead. Notre Dame threatening. Ferguson rams through the right side of the line. Notre Dame with the ball again. The pitch to Ferguson. Cuts back at the 10, runs through that tackle and fights his way down to the seven yard line. First down goal, Notre Dame, Tennessee leading. Well, it's not a first down, inches shy, so it's third down and inches and that probably is good news for Notre Dame. Gives them an extra down and this is Lish, the quarterback sneaking forward for a gain on the play of a yard. 
And it will be first down goal. Ferguson, right side. Ferguson fights his way inside the five-yard line. Battling down to the two. Notre Dame getting back into the game. Second down. Lish looking. Pass. Y'all need to share this on Facebook. Hit that share button. Was Let me get some Aztec. people in here saying go balls. Try and give away some free Tennessee merch. 12. Ferguson. He did not make it. He was stopped short. Kofer was there with Pookie. It's going to be fourth down. And Notre Dame trailing 30 to 12 will make a decision. Notre Dame is going to try for the touchdown. Yeah, they got it. It's a two. fourth down. Notre Dame to the line. They've got that power eye set. Holohan will be a man in motion to the right side. This is Ferguson. Ferguson did not make it. He did not make it. <laughs> man. Tennessee's defensive unit comes up with a early and goal line stand. Here you'll we see ought to be hit. seeing some hearts flying up on that Ferguson play in Facebook. Was by Bolton. Yeah, they hunkered down. Tennessee takes over. But the seconds tick away before Tennessee gets a play out of its deep territory, and the first half comes to a close. The score at the end of the first half is Tennessee 30, Notre Dame 12. Bill Sutton and Jimmy Streeter both now on the sideline with injuries. Streeter, who had a brilliant first half, was injured. He's out of there. And will not play anymore. Tennessee uh -oh. fumbling the kickoff. Moore scoops it up to the 15. Runs into his own man at the 20. Then maintains his equilibrium back to the 20. Out he carries the ball to Did the 25. Did he say equilibrium? Before he's rolled out. I don't know if I've ever Great heard that said in a football broadcast. Tennessee first down 10 at the 25-yard line. The quarterback will be number five. That is Jeff Olszewski. Tennessee leading. 30 to 12, but Notre Dame with tremendous explosiveness on its offense. Olszewski to the right side. Cuts up field. Olszewski carries the ball forward, fumbles it, and scrambles after. I think I believe he, might he was have down. Maintained possession. That's the case as Jeff Olszewski moves for 17 yards and a first down at the 42 yard line. This is Hubert Simpson cracking through right tackle, scurrying for a gain of five. It's second down five at the 47. Olszewski at quarterback, replacing the injured Streeter. Handing off to the plunging uh, James Berry. He gets about three. So it's third down and two. Running backs split once more. This is Berry again, and Berry, I believe, made a first down. Through the left side of the line, James Berry, Berry crashes forward for a first down and 10 to go at the Irish 47-yard line. That was long before Hubert Simpson. EB was ever thought Rounding of. up the middle for a pickup of three yards. All the down EBs. Seven at the Irish 44-yard line. Tackled by Zetek on that play. Running back split. Oshevsky the quarterback. In trouble, will run. Gets a yard, maybe two. It will be third down and five. Zetek again on the stop. Third and five. Oshevsky against the four-man Notre Dame front. Sprint action left side. Pass complete. Simpson's got a first down. Seven-yard gain. First and 10 Tennessee at the Irish 35-yard line. Running back split. Single flanker wide to the right side. Handoff. Quick opening play. Juking forward comes Berry. He twists and turns for a gain of six. Berry running tough Knocked again. Down by Whittington and Gibbons. It will be second down four at the 29-yard line. Olszewski brings his team to the line. Splitting the running backs once more. Notre Dame in a five-man front. Olszewski maybe audibling at the line. Olszewski keeper turns inside. He's got a first down. Olszewski runs to the right side and battles for the first down and 10 to go at the Notre Dame 24-yard line. Olszewski in at quarterback for Streeter. Tennessee beginning this drive. With the new quarterback, Olszewski, and the balls are grinding it out. Hubert Simpson tries the left side. Zavallian is there that time after a gain of a yard. It will be second down and nine. Olszewski moving to the right. Oh, he's corralled and dropped. That's Crable and Zavallian again on the stop. Third down, 10. 
Oshevsky running out of the pocket. Cuts to the 20. Lowers his head and lunges for a gain on the play of six yards. But Tennessee is faced with a fourth down and long. And into the ball game comes Allen Duncan to attempt a 35-yard field goal. The kick is up. The kick is good. Tennessee leads Notre Dame by a score of 33 to 12. Duncan kicking off, and Notre Dame has had a lot of troubles, trouble with the kickoffs. This one is received. And Stone returns the ball upfield for 23 yards, and it will be first down and 10 at the Irish 25-yard line, maybe the 26. Lish has gone all the way at quarterback. Rusty Lish setting up, being pressured. Screen pass, overthrown, and incomplete. It was intended for Barber. Kenny Jones got the pressure on the quarterback. Again, Lish. Again, pressure. Again, he's thrown on a sack. There you go. Brad White, Kenny Jones. Lish is sacked for minus 10. Third down and 20. Tennessee leading the defense coming to light. Four-man front, Tennessee. High formation. Lish setting up. Pass complete. Pulled down by Barber. Barber fumbles the football. There's a scramble for it. A second look. Barber hit right there by Pookie. Yeah, he coughed it up. And Tennessee's Lamont Holt has recovered. Tennessee recovers the fumble. Olszewski. Tennessee at the 26. Simpson. Down to the 20 yard line for a gain of six yards. Second down, four yards to go. Tennessee leading 33 to 12. Oshevsky, handoff this time, number 34, that's James Berry. He battles through the left side of the line for the first down, a gain of four. First down, 10 at the 16 yard line. Simpson on a cutback through the middle for a pickup of three. Second down, seven yards to go for the first down at the Irish 13 yard line. This time it's uh, Barry on a nice cutback inside. And he spins forward for a gain of five. It's got to be third down to Tennessee, leading 33 to 12. This is Simpson, left side, five. Simpson into the end zone. Touchdown, Tennessee. <laughs> Hubert Simpson with yet another touchdown in this game. Hubert Simpson scores, and Tennessee leads 39 to 12. Allen Duncan. The extra point is up. It's good. Tennessee 40, Notre Dame 12. Volunteer defense comes up with a turnover, and the offense reacts, taking advantage of the opportunity to march downfield and score. And here is Alan Duncan kicking off again toward the north end. There's the kick by Duncan. Stone at the three to the five, 10, 15, 20, 26 yard line. He's tackled. Tennessee with the five-man front. Handoff Ferguson. Fumble, scramble, picked up by Lish and saved. What a stick by Tennessee. It was Jones who blasted Ferguson, forcing the fumble, but Lish alertly recovers it. Lish at quarterback. Off play action, wants to throw, being pressured, steps out, will run with the football, gets room. Steps out of bounds as he moves just shy of the 30-yard line. Third down upcoming. The give is to Ferguson. Stutter stepping forward. Dropped by 14 Roland James as the third quarter comes to a close. You mean as the butt, butt whooping starting to, to come to a close. Band and the fans in the stands cheering the volunteers who lead Notre Dame 40 to 12. Notre Dame now moving south to north. Time to make a copyright. Um infringement break so we don't get busted by youtube get some shout outs on facebook rick over here says pookie caused the fumble yes he did john bass how you doing over here on 
uh, Facebook. Now, give me some go vols and some commentary now. I'm going to draw out a free hat or shirt at the end for a couple of you. Uh, some, some great Tennessee merchandise and a little intermission commercial. We're going to be at Tennessee Tap House on Peters Road this Saturday with Billy Ratliff, my partner, number 40, playing some cornhole and just hanging out and have a good time with the fans. Might be another VFL or two there playing some cornhole and got a lot of people coming up to play all day Saturday and just going to be a good time because it's 21 days till football time in Tennessee. Thought we'd go back down memory lane, um, watch my first game as a, really a Tennessee fan that really knew what was going on. I was 10 years old. Let's get back with it. Let's see y'all in here. At Shields Watkins Field, Lish rolling. Running. Moves forward for a gain of nine yards, making it second down and a yard to go. At the Irish 45-yard line. Again, it's Lish. Here's the pass. It is complete. Great catch made. Picks up some blocking. Carries to the 40, down to the Tennessee 35. And close to the 30-yard line. Excellent effort that time by Dickerson. Notre Dame with Lish. Throwing complete. That's Mastak on the catch. He's yes, sir, Gary. Little power run first game. Down and Notre Dame is moving. First down, 10, Notre Dame. The handoff is to Ferguson, and Tennessee clogs up the middle quite well indeed. The first man there, Ingram, then Pookie. Pookie. Lish. Deep in Tennessee territory. Notre Dame trailing. The pitch will go to Ferguson. Ferguson on the outside again is Corral. 84, Brian Ingram. 44, Pookie once more on the stop. And funny if it had been Licious, Pookie, Third down Licious. and 10 yards to go. Notre Dame trails 40 to 12. Lish with a straight drop. Here's the pass down into the end zone. It is incomplete. It was intended for Hunter. Notre Dame on fourth down and 10 will try for a first down. Ball at the Volunteers 17 yard line. Licious pass into the end zone to Ferguson is overthrown and incomplete. Martin is defending Tennessee for Tennessee and the Volunteer defense stiffens and stops the fighting Irish. So Tennessee will go on offense once more. Man in motion Jacobs. Yeah, me too, Rick. The give. Oh, a couple of yards. Quick opening play. Here comes James Berry struggling for Yardy. James Berry for 10 yards and a first down. It's Berry again. This time he is shoved backwards after getting a couple. Second and eight at the 33-yard line. Tennessee leading 40 to 12. It's Berry again. His fourth straight carry. This one good for six yards. Barry's having a good game. Third down and two. Tennessee, third down and two, trying to wedge the ball from deep in its own territory. The pitch will be at Simpson. Simpson turns, fights. I do not think he made the first down. Excellent defensive reaction by Kishi on the corner. And into the game for Tennessee will come John Warren to punt. Warren will be punting for Tennessee. Put in the comments your first game you remember as a Tennessee the fan. Pressure, but he gets We're playing my away. first game. I want to hear your con in the comments, and I'm going to draw somebody Dickerson. out. A couple of you for free Swarmed hat and shirt. By a host of volunteers. Tell me your first game. Even if you're on YouTube, you're not even Notre Tennessee Day. fan. I want to know your first game first that you remember. Tennessee to go at its 30 yard line, trailing 40 to 12 in the fourth quarter. Straight drop, Lish. Long pass, Lish. Complete. Long That's pass, Mastak. Lish. 24 yards on that pass and run. Notre Dame fighting the clock with less than nine minutes to go. To the line, the Irish. The pitch is to Ferguson. Change that. That's Carter, who's now in there at tailback. He sweeps the left side for a gain of nine. Second down, a yard to go at the 37. Lish, pass complete. Yanked down this time by Hunter. Shoved out of bounds by Martin, but it's good for the first down at the 28-yard line. Lish off play action. Here's the pass downfield. It is incomplete. A penalty marker is down on the play. Come on. Two, in fact. The pass was intended for Hunter. 
Tennessee guilty of pass interference. Notre Dame. Oh, will come have it. on. First down and 10 at the 10. Lish to Ferguson. Ferguson at the five. Watch that move as he fights into the end zone. Touchdown, Notre Dame. The quick feet of Vegas Ferguson. And Notre Dame will again try for the two-point conversion. Trailing now 40 to 18. Lish rolls right. Pass is incomplete in the end zone. Trying for two. It failed. Tennessee 40, Notre Dame 18. I believe that's the end of it. That was the final score. Notre Dame will kick off. I think. Mail. I want to see Johnny Majors here at the, the end of the game. And drills I the bet kick. he's wearing something now orange. What do you want to bet? Where it's touchdown by Roland James. Tennessee first down 10 to go at its 20-yard line. Leading now 40 to 18. Less than eight minutes to go in the contest. Jeff Olszewski has gone all the way at quarterback in the second half after Jimmy Streeter went out with the injury. This time the give is to Barry. Up the middle for two. Second down eight. Pitch Simpson in trouble at the corner. Eludes one man. Fights forward past the 25 maybe before he's shoved out of bounds. They mark the ball at the 25-yard line. Yeah, Third this down. is almost over. Olszewski's pass downfield is overthrown and incomplete. Intended for Phil Ingram. I want to see Johnny Majors. I hadn't showed him but once Fourth down just and for a five. second. So Warren Rest is in on peace, the coach. Low snap. Hurries the punt. Gets it away. Under it, Dickerson. Looking for running room. Giving ground. Get him. Continues to give ground and is sworn. Warren's punt is good for 42 yards, and then Dickerson loses 12 on the return as Holt is there to overtake him. Notre Dame with a new quarterback. That's Kegel in the football game. Flips the pass into the left flat. Complete. Carter makes the catch. Out to the 24-yard line. Second down, six. Tennessee, three-man rush. Kegel. Here's the pass. It's complete. And with the ball carrying it forward is Holohan for a gain of 16 yards and a first down. Out to the Irish 40-yard line. Gary said his first game Eagle. was Tennessee Long versus Kentucky in the mid-60s. It is incomplete. Dickerson Rick. was the man for whom the Rick pass says, was Rick says uh, Tennessee, Florida in the, the 70s. Volunteers. He doesn't remember the year, but he remembers being up in the upper Breaking deck. I want to hear where you remember your first game. It's my Tennessee first game I remember. contest. Kegel's pass, incomplete. The outstretched fingertips of Stone not quite up to the chore. So Kegel again throws, deflected, incomplete, almost intercepted. Deflected by Carlton Armstrong, number 38. Fourth down and 10, and Notre Dame is going to try for the first down and completes it to Dickerson, and he's got a first down. Kegel on target this time to Dickerson on fourth down and 10. It's now first and 10 at the Volunteer 40. The pass upfield, it's complete. That's Mastak. Mastak spun down by Carlton Peoples. Last ditch effort. Gain. First down 10, Notre Dame at the Volunteer 21. It's just a Eagle formality. Rolls right in trouble. Sacked. James is there. On the other side, Rolling that is James. Bradley. Great, great VFL. Loss of five yards. Tennessee leading 40 to 18. The fans watching the clock, ready for the post-game celebration if Tennessee yeah, can I want hold to see on the to celebration. this lead. I formation. Kegel. Pass into the end zone. It is incomplete. Good protection. Pass defense by Tennessee, stride for stride. It was Martin with Holohan. Third down, 15 to go. Kegel. Looking, the pass incomplete. Almost intercepted. Intended across the way for Dickerson. Jones is there for Tennessee defending. So here it is, fourth down and 15, Notre Dame. Here it is. Kegel's pass is complete to Dickerson, but it is short of the first down by a yard. So the hey, pass right, no Rick. complete Big game for is James short. Barry. Tennessee leading 40 to 18. 57 seconds. Handoff with the ball forward. Pounds through the right side on the give from quarterback Rudder. 
pickup of six second down four. This time it's Ford plunging up the middle and Glenn Ford bangs forward for three out to the 21 yard line third down a yard Ford for a first down. First and 10 Tennessee at the 24. This could be the last play of the football game. The gift to Ford. Ford is spun down as he moves from a yard. The fans are counting it off. Tennessee beats Notre Dame 40 to 18. There's coach. Man, coach that Scotty gets Mason. choked up there. Rest in peace, coach. The volunteers. Their fans waiting for Man, this love first ever that. meeting of the Golly. two schools in Knoxville. Coach Johnny Major shaking the hands of Coach Dan Devine of Notre Dan Dame. Dan Devine, that was his coach. The That's volunteers right. win. There's and his there, daughter. Little Mary Elizabeth Majors. She's happy. Man, that's beautiful. Tennessee 40, Notre Dame 18. Beautiful. What a great game. Going back down memory lane. Tearing down the goalpost. Hey, this was a big win for Tennessee back in 79. Big win. Notre Dame was highly ranked. I believe this is their first ever meeting. Well, look at that high tech graphics right there. Oh, that was great. Great, great to see. Let me get back up here. I'm going to read some comments. Uh, John Bass says his first game was playing Georgia in, in Tennessee. We were up 21 7 at halftime. Then Georgia puts Herschel Walker in. He ran through Bill Bates like it was nothing. Boy, he sure did. I tell you what, that, that made Herschel millions right there. Because Bill Bates was wearing Herschel out, according to Herschel Walker, that game. And he's got that one lucky play, but Herschel was a great, great man and a great, great player. One of the greatest, if not the greatest, Georgia player. Probably the one of the top five greatest running backs of all time. Um, we're going to try to do this pretty regular when i've got time kind of give me some requests and uh we'll uh i'll see if i can't find the the clips for it maybe a sped up version of like this one was but i appreciate y'all uh hanging in there and we'll give away some free hats and shirts um rick sumi i'm gonna give you something gary stooksbury i'm gonna give you something give you a hat or shirt got to see what i got in stock but it'll be something nice i promise you uh where's john bass he's made some great comments throughout the day that's that's three man y'all gonna y'all gonna break the volunteer road show but y'all come out and see me if, if y'all want this signed if you're in knoxville next saturday ever saturday actually my partner billy ratliff who does the volunteer road show with me he'll be out there and I'll hand deliver it to you and get Billy to sign it for you. Uh, so come on out to Tennessee Tap House on Peters Road, play some cornhole, and hang out with us all day this coming Saturday. And all the proceeds help our uh, hashtag Sam Strong, named after my son who was diagnosed with leukemia last last year, 2019 in January. And I'm trying to raise some money. Everybody gets 20% off of all the merch at our merch tent. They're at Tennessee Tap House. On Peter's Road. We're going to try to be there every Saturday. All day, all night, all everything. We're going to try to be there. Got some dogs running around with me. I can't put them on webcam, but they're uh, they're here. Anyway, um, I guess uh, let me get somebody over here on YouTube. I got to pick out a winner on YouTube. Where we got? Uh... 97 versus Florida was uh, Balls versus Florida. I guess he's he's there. Cade. Um, let's see. Big Val Daddy's over here trying to read some of his comments. Those old orange unis are classic. I think they need to bring it back. Don't you think so, BVD? I love those uniforms. Love them. Uh how about Tennessee Curtis? All of y'all that I mentioned, y'all email Bobby C 
at volunteerroadshow.com. It's easy. Bobby C at volunteerroadshow.com, your name, address, and phone number. And I'll make arrangements to get this stuff to you. And if you want it signed by Billy Ratliff, I'll even have him sign it when he mails it out because he mails out all our merch. So email Bobby C volunteerroadshow.com and I'll send out a hat or a shirt. You tell me if you want a hat or a shirt and I'll pick something out for you. And we've got more stuff on our website, volunteerroadshow.com. Man, we've got like 500 items we're still putting up there. I mean, a bunch. So I would say go pick something out, but there's not a lot. There's only about 15, 20, 30 items up there. So just email me, Bobby C, volunteerroadshow.com. And this was great. Uh, send me some requests uh, for uh, some for some games. And well, I'll try to do this more often. Try to do it. Good to see you, Darren Kelly. But y'all have been watching me for a while. Y'all know what's coming next. Thanks for tuning in. Go Vols. If the Notre Dame players didn't know the words to Rocky Top at this game, they sure knew them when they left. I promise you.